Now let's see the Bayer Savart law. Bayer Savart law is the fundamental law of the magnetics. It gives the magnetic field by a small current element and is based on the experimental facts. Let us consider a small element DL vector of a wire of cross section area A carrying current I. If small n is the number of charge carriers per unit volume, each of charge Q equal to E and moving with a drift velocity VD vector then I equal to N E A VD. The quantity of charge flowing in time DT DQ equal to I DT equal to N E A VD DT. Since VD into DT equal to DL, therefore DQ equal to N E A DL. The magnetic field due to the current element DL vector at any point P at a distance R vector db vector equal to mu naught upon 4 pi dq multiplied by vd vector cross r vector upon r cube equal to mu naught upon 4 pi n e a dl multiply by vd vector cross r vector upon r cube equal to mu naught upon 4 pi n e a vd multiply by dl vector cross r vector upon r cube or db vector equal to mu naught upon 4 pi i dl vector cross r vector upon r cube or db equal to mu naught upon 4 pi i dl sin theta upon r square equation 1 this is called by its avat law the field due to the whole current carrying conductor is given by b vector equal to integration db vector or b vector equal to mu naught upon 4 pi integration i dl vector cross r vector upon r cube equal to mu naught upon 4 pi i l vector cross r vector upon r cube equation 2